Uh, hey guys, my name is Rabbi. Uh, I just wanted to speak to you lot on here on social media platform just to share something with you. I really hate cameras and for me to do it, it was very, very hard. I had to fight with myself to really do this. But I have to, I've got a message from the Lord who he has given me to show with people and I just feel like a burden it on me that I have to say and what I've saw and what I got told that so I can feel free myself because at the moment I'm scared as well. I feel like I just have to say it out so I can be free as a person because I'm, I'm scared for myself as well. So and two weeks ago I had a dream and uh, I was in a vision. Uh, so I was in a gra there was a graveyard, I was in dead bodies, loads of dead bodies. But I didn't understand the meaning of it at all. So then the following day, I got another dream, another vision of uh, stocking up for the things that's about to come. So for me, for my own understanding, I just go, that means I need to go buy a lot of food for the, for the coronavirus that we've got at the moment. So let me just get a lot of food for my family. So we've got enough, enough food for us to eat during this hard period of time. But then um, I spent some time in I spent some time in prayer. So the Lord showed me said, I'm not talking about just uh, stacking up of the food only, but I'm speaking about the spiritual side. I want you to prepare for me when I'm coming back. I want you to want my people to know when I'm coming back for them to be ready because many souls are going to perish. The souls that are people already dying already. Imagine how many souls are going are perishing already. So God is crying, is is unhappy, saying many people are perishing. So he want people to be saved. So I please share with each other, like just to save as we can, as we've got time. And um, so it all is it. We have to prepare about the Lord's return. Everything that's written in the book of Revelation is happening now. So the end days are here. And I literally plead you, each one of you, like young people, take your life serious because we are living the last days. Forget about having more money, having nice cars. It just, for me, this period have told me a lot that seeing many people dying, it just changed my mind. I'm like, these people are like, it's me. So what I'm, what do, difference between me and them, I'm not better than these people. So, and one of the verse that the Lord has given me uh, it's the book of Revelation 2 and the book of Revelation 3, which the Lord talks about a lot. Repent, repent, repent. Turn to me while there's still time. I'm knocking at the door. So the Lord doesn't want us to perish. He wants to save our souls. He really loves us dearly. He wants us to know. He wants us to be with him. So I just had to share this because I feel like a burden on me. I just want to share with other people. So if you can share it with your friend everywhere so the message can be heard because I've done my part. The Bible says, he who has heard the, he, he who has heard the message, it's on him, it will be judged based on what we've heard. So you that are hearing this, you're going to be judged. So help other people to save their souls as well. The Bible says uh, in a book of Acts, Acts 38, and repent of your sins and be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. So we are living the last time. Change your ways because the time is here. Don't let social media fool you. Don't let anything fool you at this moment because this moment is about being focused, thinking about your soul, thinking about where you're going to go because it's crazy. It's crazy. May God bless you. May you and your loved ones stay at home. Be prayerful. Uh, we're going to be this in Jesus' name. And uh, Jesus is on our side. The book of um, Psalm 91 says, when we have him as our refuge, when we come to the Lord as our refugee, he protects us, he looks after us. So we are safe. So for those that believe or that don't believe, so God, God saying, come back to me, return to me in truth and spirit. So the Bible says in the book of Isaiah 55, uh, seek the Lord while you can find him. So this is the time if you can find him, I plead you, Young people, old women, seek for him because this is the time right now. We are coming near the end. The time is here. Everything that's been written in the Bible, it is happening. We are living the moment. I plead you, literally, just 
change your ways, change your ways. Jesus Christ is the only way. He's the truth, he's the life. I just want, may God bless you all. That's all I had to share with you. And uh, yeah, thank you guys.